What up, YouTube? It's your boy, True Hero. And today, we got some spicy tech. As you can see, Miracle Fusion Gladiator Beast. The top decks in the Edison format, aside from Dragons, are all Valiant Sirocco decks or Miracle Fusion decks. So I figured Miracle Fusion just might be the edge to push GBs into the top again. And also, I got a special guest. My boy OG, okay? He actually came in top 16 with Veyu Turbo. What tournament was it? Uh, Edison World Championship Qualifier from the uh, Format Library Discord. That's right. That's right. So here he is. He's going to be with me on commentary today, and we're going to be playing some Miracle Fusion Glads. So what do you think? Tell me your honest thoughts, dog. Good. Um, what were you thinking? <laughs> listen, listen. I think GBs are terrible. All right, but sometimes if you just believe, you might be able to clutch out a victory. Sometimes you just need a miracle. You, you think you're a really good player just based on adding heroes? Yeah, so like there's actually not that many heroes in waters, right? There's only, I guess, six heroes, which is quite a decent number, right? Triple Plasma, Stratos, and Rhoda, so five. All right, I don't know how to count. So there's five heroes, and even though there's only three waters in the main deck, Mermillo, Double Ready Ari. The kind of theory behind it is like, since GBs can tag out, you always have access to a water monster, right? So there shouldn't, in a perfect world, there shouldn't, I say this loosely in air quotes, air quotes be a uh, shortage of heroes and waters. But we'll see, dog. We'll see. All right. I'm only gonna right. play. I'm only gonna play one set because I, I just I don't believe in Gladiator Beast. I really don't. All right. Well, if you don't believe Gladiator Beast, then then you should have played this up. Listen, listen. Sometimes you just got to try. You got to try. All right. All right. So hopefully we're all going to be playing against George George Miller. All right. All right. What are we feeling? Rock, paper, or scissors? I failed. All right. Uh, rock. All right. Hit him with the rock. No. All right. Scissors. See, he was feeling rock. All right. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. No. Yeah. No. No. It's already going bad. It's already going bad. It's okay, it's okay. Gladiator Beast is a better is a better deck going second. I mean, yeah, we'll see. Well, the thing he's not going to send a monster. The thing is, right, in Edison format, so many decks set monsters. But the main reason why I don't like Gladiator Beast is they lose against a monster with over 1,800 attack. I remember one time I was playing against Lightsworn, and then my opponent goes like, normal summon Garoth, and I couldn't even out a Garoth. Oh, one man's taking. Yes. All right. No Raiko. No Raiko. Please. Okay. The Beastie oh. already. All right. Well, we're just going in, dog. We're going in. We're going in. This is what. This no is what. Palace, no deep prison. No torrential. Oh. Damn. As soon as you say that. As soon as you say that. Damn. And the saying oh, in too. And the again. Oh. All right. It's fine. At least we get to figure out what deck he's playing. Sure about that. Yeah, dog. Sang say I told you. Sangan reveals what deck you're playing. It's weird though, because decks that play Veyu typically don't play Sangan, right? Because Veyu they typically don't. Yeah, Veyu Turbo doesn't play Sangan and Black Wings don't play Sangan. So it's like kinda weird that he searched out the Veyu. I think it's lean much more towards Well now yeah. we know. <laughs> well now we know, right? <laughs> it's, it's leaning much toward Veyu Turbo. And my man, he's about this oh. Oh. I was about to say 4K life is 4K life, but this is this is a bit more than 4K life. This is 4200 life. It's all right. We're going to um, we're gonna honestly we don't even need to activate D Prison because we could just go like oh. summon um, uh, what's his face, Laquari, and then we can yeah yeah. But Look I'm not gonna run over right. Yeah. But I'm not gonna do that because it's just too much life. It's way too much life. And also, he's playing uh, Bay Turbo, so we want these guys banished anyway. Now, me, I'm a Chad, Gary. I'm a Chad. So if I didn't have this Bestiari in my hand, I would summon Laquari, attack, and tag out for Bestiari. It's just because I'm a Chad. All right, here we go. No bottomless. No deep prison. Let's just get there. Yo! <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe this. I can't oh. believe this. Oh my god. 
All right, well, I'm not, I don't want to set Book of Moon because, like, if he has MST, I lose because none of my monsters yeah. can out 17. Literally, none of them can well, out 17. You're, you're forced to pass. Yeah, I also, I don't think he has, like, Veyu or Soroko because he went first turn Sangan and Search and a Veyu, right? So I don't think he has Well, anything. you can just drop him right here and then Burial. Stop. I'll just kill you. Stop. Oh, oh my I'll, I'll redite. God. That's always pretty good. You cursed me. How many darks in a grave? There's one. There should only be one. Yeah. Now there's okay. two. Okay. Yeah. Anyway. Well, yeah. Just... just attack, attack. Yup. There we go. Now listen, dog. He had the Solemn. He had the Torrential. There's no way right, he has another I mean, card. This card is fake. That means this card is fake. Card is fake. All right. Because he would have. And the Seer does, like you were thinking. Yup. Because literally, if it's any other trap. Mirror Force, D Prism, Bottomless. He wanna not have used Solemn Judgment. Like if it's any other trap. Um, I mean what sucks is my hand, but you know, we even got this miracle fusion, but we have no heroes. We in air quotes have access to waters, but no heroes, despite the fact that we play five, so whatever. Um so I think it's just a simple attack tag out. Uh I actually yep. probably need to tag out for Reddy Ari here because plague is a problem. But also, Greffer's a problem too. So it's quite difficult. Um, I'm going to get this Darius out of my hand. Uh huh. Yeah, I, uh, yeah, I agree. Yeah, because I want to tag out probably into a quest. Or... Yo, you, oh. can, you can't make this up. You oh, can't those are, those make this problems. up. You cannot make this up. Oh, well. Yeah, well, now I don't have a choice. Oh. This this is and now he just drew that card. Oh no, he already had that. But still, wait. If he, he already because he, he, did, he didn't shuffle it. it. Yeah, he didn't shuffle his hand because I was po watching. It was the middle card that he pitched, which like it doesn't make any sense because if he already had it, he should have pitched it last turn to thin out his deck. Yeah. All right. Whatever. Yeah. Well, I mean, the fact that he pitched Necro Gardner is not good. Because, like, that just means I can't get an attack off. Oh, you're probably going to lose this game. Uh, I mean, I'm I'm not going to lie. It's looking kind of bad. I'm, I'm not going to lie about that. Well, you have to move that. Yep. All right, maybe he won't attack. He's going to attack. Come on. All right, listen. I have right. How are you gonna he's, get over Necro? He's finally out of bed. Okay, well, if he just has everything, all right. If he just has everything, well, this ain't terrible because he drew Wabaku. Yeah, I drew some defense. All right, well, I think honestly, I just go attack, and then like after I attack, the attack goes through. It doesn't go through, and then I can Wabaku next turn and summon guys Arius. Right. Yeah. So hopefully, so far I haven't got off a single attack. Hopefully, I can get this attack. Necro, okay, that's fine. And as long as that card's not like dust, you know what? No, you have to set those. Yes, exactly. Because if he has MST Dust Tornado, and he goes, hits my Wabaku, I'm going to be tight, dog. I'm going to be so tight. <laughs> Like, this is fine. Also, because if he goes attack with Greffer in order to go for game, and I go Wabaku, then, like, he even loses a monster. So, Wabaku's not just a complete minus one. And in a perfect world, dog, right? He goes attack for Greffer um, to go for, you know, game, and I go Wabaku, and then I go tag out into Mermillo, pop his tomato, and I go draw for turn one of my five heroes. Flip up Miracle Fusion. You're hoping for two walls. You, you, you're acting like he's not going to make Brio, Brio here. I mean, he could do that, but then he won't have any cards to pitch. Hmm. 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 Yep. So I don't think he's going to do that, dog. Yep. Like I said, it's lining up perfect. Oh, wait, what? No. He didn't even go for game. Okay, well, that's fine. I. Look at that. Look at that. Finally, one of my five heroes. But now it's like, because he didn't attack, like, 
summoning Prisma now is useless. Because actually, I don't even have any targets. Because both Laquaris are in the grave, and Beastary is in my hand. Prisma is actually just oh. useless. Right You're now. just going to have to summon this little Beastary and go in. It sucks because I use my Book of Moon, but yeah, we're definitely going to summon the Beastiari. Alright, so we're going to set this. Royal Oppression and I Cry. Royal Oppression and I Cry. Well, you just have to play. You have to just play through it. Play you through don't have it. choice. Play through it, dog. How do I play through it? How do I play through it? I just, I just lose. Just... Alright, we hitting one or two? Two, come on. Alright, alright, I'm just asking. I'm just asking. All right, so we're hitting this guy for sure. And also, we're hitting a back row. Evens, odds. So wait, w this the middle one has been there forever, right? Yeah, that's, that's been there forever. All right, that means this is enchainable then. So the new one, of course. Of wow. Course, of that's crazy. Of course, dog. Of course. They made stuff. What is this thing? Of course. This is wild. This is actually just wild. Is there anything I can do? No. No, that's game. No, it's not game yet. I have Wabaku. Alright? It's not game uh, yet. It's not game, but it's game. Listen. You want to show the Wabaku, though? Actually, that doesn't matter. Oh, look All at right, that. Well, look game. at that. Look at that. He even got the burial, just like Yax. He even got the burial. Uh, five turns late. Alright. I don't think there's a single card I can draw to help me win this game. Because the problem is, like, even if I draw a Test Tiger, which is quite a good draw, um... Boy, this is sad to watch. This is so sad. I don't mind showing... Wait, what does this do? Stradicator. Uh, oh my god. He's gonna call traps. Well, he can call traps all he wants. I'm gonna chain it. Okay. And then we'll reveal this. Damn. It's like I kind of want to scoop now because I didn't want to reveal that, but whatever. That's why I said go nuts. You're already going to win no matter what. Listen. Quitters quit. And I'm not a quitter, champ. All right. Even though. I'm not saying you're quitting. All right. <laughs> you're just making a tactical retreat. <laughs> <laughs> tactical retreat. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I'm not going to lie. It looks near impossible to win. And, like, even if I do summon Absolute Zero, it's like he has... Uh... It still has a deck one back here. All right, we're just going to... We're not even going to... Okay, all right, okay. All right. <laughs> you even said it yourself. Tactical what retreat. What kind of possible here? Tactical retreat, tactical retreat. Uh, yeah, so we're up against a weird version of Veyu Turbo that plays Sangan. Sure. Sangan, Tomato... Starlight Road. Like, uh, so that means for, for the rest of the game, for the rest of the match, we're, we're just hitting one card. Maybe he's like, took out the Hamster Ryko package and opted just to play more darts. I don't know. Probably. Maybe. Yeah. Who knows? He also is playing Eradicator. Main deck. Uh, main deck. Main deck. That's wild. Uh, That's wild. I didn't even think about that. That's actually just crazy. So those were the uh, outlier cards. Uh so, Starlight Road, Sagan, Missing Tomato, Eradicator. Those are the four cards. Uh, so, we have to keep that in mind. I think this is all I can do for side. I can possibly throw in Smashing Ground, but, like, eh. Uh, no, I think I think Consecrate is actually really good in this matchup in particular. Yeah, he's, uh, because... Because he's, uh, he's playing a lot more darks. And it doesn't seem like he's playing the Hamster Ryko package, like yeah. you mentioned. Yeah, he's, uh, he's on Copium. Alright, so anyway, now we figure out what are we going to take out. Uh, yeah, I mean, I guess that's it. All these other guys we need. I'm a big fan of Soul Release, but the problem with Soul Release is it's too slow. It's too slow against this version, of, against this deck. Yeah, it's too slow. Like, this version of the deck, ooh. If I go oh. first turn, summon Consecrated, and he just... Ooh, my hand is nice, actually. Anyway. My hand is real good. Yeah, but the thing is, if I summon this Consecrated, I can't go Prisma Test Tiger to Geyserius play because uh, right. Geyserius is a dark. But, I mean, I'm still summoning this Consecrated. Like, don't get me wrong. 
Don't get me wrong. All right. And if he goes first turn, summon like a non dark monster and run over this consecrated, I'm going to be heated. Okay. Well, if he it. does, uh, you just Pokemon it. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, hmm. I think he doesn't have anything. I'm not going to do Prisma Test Tiger because, uh, I mean, I guess I could go like Prisma Test Tiger into like Laquari to get like offensive. But like, I just feel like that's a waste of Prisma Test Tiger. So I'm curious, dog. I'm curious, George. I'm curious, George. Let's find out. Of course. Oh, he is playing this. Of fucking course, bro. Of fucking course. Of fucking course. That's so crazy. What? That's How's he fitting crazy. All this? Oh, at least, at least Stargard was gone. That's crazy. I can't believe that. I can't believe that either. All right, whatever. Um, yeah, we're just gonna end. Yeah, how much you can do? Ah, that's so annoying. That's so annoying. All right. Yeah, we're gonna take all this damage. That's fine. We'll take it all, and then next turn we'll Prisma Test Tiger. Clear your board. Ah, oh, man, it's a lot of damage too. But he has to... Oh, he didn't do it. Oh, yeah, because... Oh, okay. On the, on what? All right. Sure. All right. He's, he's really thinking. I guess maybe he's scared of Torrential, but I think this guy, he's just going to ape it up. Uh, yep. That's right. I told you. He's going to beat on his chest. He's going to ape it up. And he's like, you're going to take all this damage. All right? He's just, he's just howling to the moon. Even though apes don't howl to the moon, but that's what he's doing. And like, I gotta save Book of Moon for like some defensive play. Please don't have any back rows. My God. Now I gotta go for uh, it. I have heavy storm. I don't care. Oh. I mean, like. Oh no. If that's really bad. If you have everything, I have no traps though. That's wild. I have zero traps. This is, this could be really bad against all the types of ducks. Uh, yeah. That's wild. Alright, we gotta show him this too. Alright, bro, I know. Give me a second. Like, he just clicked it so fast. Like, give me a second. Okay? Alright. All right, so, uh, I feel like. Snack and in a grape. No, he doesn't. He, he just has okay. a bunch of darks. So I feel like, as much as I hate to say it, I feel like I got to hit him. I got a heavy storm. I, I would too. Because if this attack, he's going to go down yeah. so much. Well, he's not going to go down that uh, much. Then, but anyway. And then you have Pokemon for defense. Yeah. Uh, and the worst comes uh, well, sure. Yeah. Good Doesn't thing matter. I did that because he would have right. did his thing. Um... Yeah. If I was really pro, I would have set the heavy. If I was really pro. But well, we're heavy. not gonna play like we're not gonna play like that here. All right. Oh yeah, this isn't great. Uh yeah, I mean we're not. We're just gonna do what we can. It's crazy. He uh, eradicated me two games in a row, and luckily for me. He hasn't won a game because of Eradicator. He's won because Gladiator Beasts suck. Alright. Before, all right, so if you have goals through all this, you're We definitely insane. have to get uh, Ready Ari, which is good because that's our water. And yep. I guess Ready Ari, and we can also. I mean, we already have water. Ready Ari and Laquari. It's just looking like that. It's just looking like that. Imagine me able to tag out Kaiserius for Bestiari. Just imagine that world. If only. Alright, get rid of this. Uh, Yo, if he summons Chaos Sorcerer against me, he's the best. He's actually the best. Also, I'm going to keep track because I know a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh! players don't know how to count. That was one out of three. 
So, nope. I also don't like this. Like, you don't need to keep this there. All right, like it's it's okay. You don't need to keep that there. All right, this is two, and I'm gonna write it there. That's two out of three. All right, so yeah. All right, well, we just attack because, like, even if he has mirror force, I have book of moon, which hopefully he yep. doesn't have mirror force. All right, we attack here. Samster's fine. Yeah, because I'm at 21. And if it's a right sure. throw, it's fine too. All right, yeah, like this is sure. fine. All right. So was it okay? Well, now we knew it was a bear force, but now it now it's 100. percent He can't have it now. Well, he just set this, so it could have been mirror force. I said, I hope it's not. Well, he just milled it. No, nah, no. Nah, well, now he just milled it, but I mean, like when I entered in the right. battle phase. Um. So I mean, I don't think it's torrential because like it doesn't make sense to set a torrential behind a Raiko. Uh, yeah, he has uh, a single card, and now if it's torrential, I don't care because I have double miracle fusion. And that's yeah. three out of three. All right. All right. So yeah. Oh yeah. Finally, we get to see miracle fusion glads. Oh, it's crazy. It's actually just crazy. All right, so we're not scared of Mirror Force, which is gone. We're not scared of Torrential. We're not scared of anything. And honestly, I don't see him coming back um, because it's really hard to out double Miracle Fusion. I would agree. Yeah, that's right. Even though he savaged me both games with Eradicator... Yeah, that's right. Admit defeat. So, yeah. Okay. Uh, how much we can do about Eradicator, to be honest? Yeah, there's nothing. And, like, even Starlight Road doesn't uh, protect against Eradicator. It's like, the only thing I think we can do is side out traps for more spells. But I think, like, he's going to catch he's gonna catch on. Because he called traps both games, and, like, he hasn't hit anything. So, it's like, if I put more spells in... He'll just like call spells. You know what I mean? Because right. I can side out yeah, some of these traps for spells, but then it's just like I feel like I get hurt more. So right. I'm just gonna keep it like this. And like if he just if he just sacks me, then like he just sacks me. Yeah. Yeah. I think he's I think it's good that for some reason he's he hasn't hit anything. Yep. Uh because he might just actually call spells this time. Uh, in this situation would be bad. I mean, but. yeah. If he calls spells, there's just literally nothing I can do about that. So, the cool thing is Book of Moon chainable. So, like, let's say he goes, like, turn one um, Eradicator. I could just go, like, chain book. And then I can summon, like, a GB attack and tag out. And, like, because I, I have uh, both Prisma and Rhoda, like, I'm not going to have a shortage of heroes this game. So, and, you know, waters are easy to come by because I can just tag them out. So, like, now, if I just get a Miracle Fusion, like, I'll be happy. But the fact that he pitched Necro just, like, shows me... Oh, okay. Yeah, like, this works out perfectly. That's really good. Yep. Uh, so, we kind of... Wow, his graveyard. Mm, good. Good grave. Pretty good. Um, so, we're going to think here. We're definitely going to activate Rota tar because, like, the only target is... Prisma and uh, Stratos, and we got to thin out the deck. So we already got a Prisma, so there's no need to get a second one. So we'll just get this. Uh, um, this is what we summon here. So I can summon, honestly, I'm going to summon uh, a quest and I'm going to attack, and then either he necros, and if he necros, cool. And if he doesn't necro, I book a moon, and then I tag out into uh, like Mermillo. So okay. that's what I'm going to do. And then you have uh, more Shira's follow-up? Okay. Yep. That's exactly right. All right. All right. So we're going to uh, attack here. And we're going to give him the thumbs up. All right. Cool. Listen, I'm setting both awesome. dogs. If, he, if, he's that, if he sets the pro heavy storm, then like George Miller, like you're you're the best. Or I guess technically it'd be Jorge, right? But anyway, you're you're just the best. You're literally the best. Now, 
Wow! <laughs> wow! Yo, dog, he's the best. Uh, he's the he best. The he's the best. He's the best. He's the best. That's insane. Yep. Oh. It's like, it's not a huge minus because, like, Chariot, you can always get back. But, like, it just sucks it's because... A huge, it's a huge minus in, in tempo. Yeah, in tempo, right. In tempo, it's a, it's it's uh, it's like we lost. In tempo, like, we, we're, we're cooked. We are cooked right now. We're super cooked. Uh, you need a test tiger badly. Damn. Ray Miller, he's the best. You guys are watching. But, I mean, like, all hope's not, like, super lost because I can still get a Miracle Fusion, which would be, you know, oh, oh, well, never mind. Never mind. Uh, never mind. Are you dead? No, I'm not dead, but I'm dead. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm not dead, but I'm dead. Oh, uh, test Tiger in a dream. Uh, yeah, it's definitely a dream. It's definitely a dream that's needed. Oh, oh no, no, uh -oh. I'm just, I'm just dead. Nope, nope, <laughs> nope. You're right. I'm just, I'm just dead. I'm just dead. Oh, uh, oh. What well, a sequence of cards. Well, I mean, yeah. Like I said, Jorge Miller, he's the best. That's, what a sequence of limited cards. That's just wild. That's just wild. I just... Alright, I mean, yeah. GG. Oh. Yeah. Alright, well... Alright, guys, that's it. Alright. Miracle Fusion Glads. Okay. Even though we technically didn't see Absolute Zero hit the field, Game 2, it was over because of the power of Miracle Fusion. I, uh... I hope this shows everyone, if you're thinking about playing GBs for any event ever, don't. All right. Any last words, champ? Uh, uh, not after that game. Yeah. There, there's literally nothing to say. There's literally nothing to say. We lost against a sub... And he had Necro in the grave. I mean, Burial. We lost against a subpar version of Vade Turbo. All right. Whatever. I'm out. Until next time, guys. Take care. Peace. Subscribe or you too will be sent to the Shadow Realm.